I'm standing here with Honeywell uh, at their G450 where they conducted the biofuel flight to Paris. They used the same route as Charles Lindbergh used in 1927, and I'm just wondering, what is the significance? Why did you choose that route? So we, we picked the route that Charles Lindbergh flew in order to be able to help us uh, get uh, the, the opportunity to show what aviation biofuels can do. This was the first transatlantic crossing using aviation biofuels, and we thought that it would be a very nice uh, fitting tribute to, to Mr. Lindbergh to also fly the same route that he did when he first tra uh, transited the, the North Atlantic. What do you think is the emerging region for biofuels? Well, there are several different emerging regions and there's several different possibilities in terms of fuels that can be used. Um, this particular flight used camelina, which is able to be grown in areas where there's dry land wheat. Uh, a wheat which is also grown in Europe and Australia and throughout the world. So it really gives us a lot of opportunity. There are many other crops that can be grown in many other regions of the world as well. What were the emission savings on this flight? This particular flight saved 5.5 metric tons of carbon dioxide by employing biofuels. If you equate that savings out to the whole aviation industry as a whole, the savings would be over 50 million metric tons on an annual basis if the fuel were adopted at around a 10% level. When will biofuel be a viable option for business aviation, do you think? So I believe biofuels are a viable option for business aviation today. Uh, we have been able to show that the fuel can be used. The ASTM certification, which will allow use, is, uh, is pending and should be granted within the next 30 days. And in addition to that, the price of the fuel should be uh, fairly comparable to what many aviation customers, particularly in the business jet industry, pay uh, at various FBOs around the country. So can you tell me a little bit about the biofuel that was used? Where was it produced? This particular fuel was produced by uh, Honeywell at a facility we operate in Houston, Texas. Uh, again, it came from a material called camelina, which is a natural plant uh, grown. It was originally grown in Northern Europe and now is cultivated in, in uh, the western parts of the United States. It's a cover crop used in dry, dry land wheat rotation, so it does not interfere with the food crops uh, and food development, which is very important to us. Thank you very much. Thank you.